welcome to rd cloud compute in this video i'm going to explain how to install a certificate authority or a certificate server in windows 2008 server for this i have a windows 2008 r2 server attached to joined to my domain rd cloud compute local let's Go to server manager and enable the certificate authority role. Just select Active Directory Certificate Services. Click Next. Next. Yeah. If you want, we can you can enable the web enrollment, but I'm gonna stick with certificate authority role. This we will just enable the certificate authority. I will cover the, uh, another video for a web enrollment. Now we go to next. There are two options enterprise and standalone. Since I have an Active Directory integrated, I'm going to use the enterprise one. If you don't have an Active Directory, you can use a standalone. And yeah, this is since it is my first uh, certificate server, I'm going to select root CA. So if you have an existing server, root CA, if you want to add it, you can choose subordinate. And since it is my first one, I don't have a private key. So I'm going to choose the create private key option. In this I'm going to select to SS SHA 256 and leave the keys length as and default. Click next. Yeah, I'm going to change the uh, uh, common name to from host name to say root CA. Click next. Yeah, this is the validity for the root certificate uh, root ca certificate server uh, certificate self-signed certificate i'm going to leave it to default five years and these are the database location and lock location i'm going to leave it default we don't use cia so just click next it will install the role okay now it is installed just close this one. Let's say successfully installed. No need to restart server. Just close. Now go back to the server manager. Expand the roles. Yeah, now we can see the Active Directory certificate. So I have an enterprise PKA which is root CA. I have a self-signed certificate for the for the root CA, which is valid for five years. Yeah, all looks good. Just go back and expand the root CA. So you can see if the cert a certificate issued, revoked any revoked certificates. And since it is a new server, I have only one server issued, one certificate issued. Sorry. Let's open up MMC console, add a certificate, snap in select certificates and select computer certificate if you go to the personal expand personal and certificate you can see the root set server self signed certificate installed pre-installed okay i'm gonna add an, another snap in certificate snap in for my user account and create a new uh, certificate and test the cert certificate server is working select this time select my user account and click ok expand the personal and certificates so i have the previous certificate i'm going to delete it and recreate So I don't have any certificates. So I'm going to request for a new certificate. Request new certificate. So next, it will automatically pick up a certificate set authority details from Active Directory. So I'm going to click next. In this I say use a certificate. Yep, select the user template click enroll it 
it's valid for 365 days which is one year now enroll successfully completed let's click on view certificate see it is issued from root certificate CA. we have a private key and all those details short 56 everything looks good let's finish and go back yeah i have a certificate issued for administrator from the root ca all looks good thank you for watching